Hi guys, Dane here, and today we are going to attempt to do My Cat Chooses My TBR. So Biggie is asleep at the moment. I'm actually pre-filming this because I don't want to wake him up because he'll be annoyed. So I'm going to wait for him to wake up and then we're going to go freestyle with the camera and and hopefully make this happen. I, I don't know whether this is going to work or not, but we'll see. So yeah, let's cut to whatever footage I manage to get and then hopefully I will remember to do a recap at the end. All right, now... Now, Mr. Man, you like to sit on books, don't you? So maybe if I put them out, you'll choose one to sit on without me having to give you treats. So the first choice is going to be between Ollie Jacobs, Kirk Sandblaster and Zlar's World War. So this is an indie book, and this is about book number five, I think, in a series. Then we have Agatha Christie, Why Didn't They Ask Evans? And then we have Nosferatu by Joe Hill. Hey, Biggie. You're getting very close to the camera, young man. Which which book are you going to choose? How are we going to do this? Shall I do it with some treats? Come on, then. Let's do this. We've got, we've got to pick one. Okay. All right, Biggie, look over here, look. Look at that. All right, we have treats. We have treats on the books. What are we going to go for, Biggie? Is that it? You went for it. He went for. All right. Thank you, Biggie. You can eat those two as well if you want. Uh, he picked Kirk Sandblaster and Zlar's World War. Followed by Why Didn't They Ask Evans? <laughs> okay. All right. Well, that's pick number one. Okay. So for book number two, we have Inferno by Dan Brown. John Wyndham, Day of the Triffids. Hey, bud, how you doing? And Double Sin and Other Stories by Agatha Christie. I mean, he looks like he's already picked one, but I haven't put the treats down yet. Oi, Biggie. All right, then, buddy, go on. That's a wobble board, mate. My driving guy left, let, get, decided to lend me his wobble board. Look, what's this over here? What about these? <laughs> Biggie boy. Which one? Which one are you going for? Look, they've got treats on them. Which one? Hey, they're over there. Come on. Stop posing just because you want people to look at you on BookTube. Oh. Oh, was that a selection? That was. You picked Day of the Triffids by John Wyndham. Thank you, cat. All right, okay, next two books. Good boy, you're doing good. And you're doing good. You're doing way better than I thought you'd do. Number three, are you ready? All right then, which one are you gonna pick? We've got The Well of Lost Pots by Jasper Ford, Everything's Eventual by Stephen King, and The Lion Game by Ruth Ware Biggie. Which one? Which one? Yeah, which one, which one? Stop, stop rubbing against my legs. Come on, buddy. Which one? Which one do you want? Which one do you want? Go on. Pick one. Go on. I'll let you go outside once you pick me books. Go on, then. What are you... Oh. He has, he has picked up the scent. You, the Lion Gate. No. You don't want that one. Which one do you want, then? Go on, then. Pick one of them. You gotta pick one. Stop rubbing your head against that. Come on. Pick one. Biggie boy. Come on. Come on. Pick one. Come and have a treat. Come and have a treat, look. Come and have a treat. Do, 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 do. You can go outside when you have a treat, buddy. Alright? Go on. Go on. Oh, I thought you were going to take Stephen King then. Go on. Pick one. Pick a book. Stop looking around like a derpy derp. Okay. Thank you. Okay. So you've gone for The Lion Game by Ruth Ware. One more, buddy. One more and then you can go outside, all right? <laughs> I know, buddy. I know. All right. Almost done. Almost done. It's a hard life being a cat, isn't it? So... 
here we have Need You Dead by Peter James, which I believe is a Roy Grace uh, crime novel. Charlotte Street by Danny Wallace. And uh, Fragile Things by Neil Gaiman. So biggie. Yes, succeeded in confusing him. Which one are you going for then? Which one? You need to eat another treat and then you can go outside, bud. Go on. Come on. Which one are you gonna have? No, that's, no, look, have a treat. Go on. You normally always meowing for treats. Why don't, have you had your fill, have you? Go on, pick one more, cat. One more. One more, come on, get one of these. One of these, you've just walked over one, look. Look, you've done all of the hard work. I only, this is the last one, this. Come on. Pick a treat, pick a treat, cat, and then I will let you go out. It's a very simple exchange. Yeah? Did you... You see, the thing is, he's silent as well, aren't you? You just had the... what? So he's picked Need You Dead by Peter James, and I didn't even hear him chew it. I don't think he did. I don't think he bothered. <laughs> All right, Kat, you can go outside now. Go on, then. Go on, then. Have fun. Thank you for picking my TBR. Okay, well miraculously, at least for me, I'm filming this on the same day, although I am wearing a shirt because I've been filming my wrap-up videos. But uh, yes, we, uh, we were successful in the end. So, uh, just to recap, these are the uh, four books that Biggie picked for me. I'm gonna read these and then I'm gonna do a separate wrap-up of these uh, once, whenever I finish them, which will probably be at some point this month. But uh, he picked Ollie Jacobs, Kirk Sandblaster and Zlar's World War. He picked John Triffitt, John, John Triffitt, Day of the Windhams. <laughs> he picked John Wyndham, The Day of the Triffids. The Lion Game by Ruth Ware. And Need You Dead by Peter James. So these are the books that I am going to be reading. Thank you, Kat. I'm looking forward to making a start. I'm going to make a start on them this evening. So yeah. With that, uh, obviously, let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books, and if so, what you thought of them. Let me know if you've done one of the uh, My Cat Picks My TBR videos as well, because I always like seeing people's cats. Hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video, hit subscribe for more, and I'll see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.